YouTube Retro Gamer Jail back again and uh, looking at two ZX81s today and I've been playing with these for quite a while and I want to see what I can do with them so I've just brought a few new things for the 81 I'll show you this one quickly first of all we've had two new keyboard upgrades so there's the old one and that's uh, Intel that's old copyright there you go 1980 and you can see there the cables are a bit worn away over the 20 odd, 30 odd years of use there's the other one and the new ca new keyboards come from a company called Sell My Retro well it's not a company, they got from Rap Software who then place it on sellmyretro.com which is a bit like uh, eBay, I'll link the descriptions below and also brought from the same company Rap Software one of these, this is a, a ZX Spanned this allows me to run SD cards, there's an 8 gig card there on the 81 and load up .p emulator files there's a reset switch resets it there's the interface which connects to the ZX81 card connector and if you zoom in on the 81's new keyboards you'll see a few new commands there it goes, about the best I'm going to get on the Z key you can see it says cat stroke copy and on the S key it's got delete and L print, and on the G key it's got go uh, config L list. Okay, and what you can do with them is when you plug in the ZX band, the new commands come up. So cat copy instead of the same copy, it come up cat, which brings the directory up. Uh, delete obviously deletes files, and config you can configure the device so you can have the old old uh, commands working again. So if you have, so if you regularly use like L print and L list uh, print to a printer. You can still use them just by configurating the device. And if you want to go back to the default configuration, all you do is you press and hold that switch down for about five seconds whilst the power's on and it resets the chip there to the default configuration. So what I'll do now, I'll uh, plug it into my TV set and I'll show you the device in action. Catch you soon. ZX81's back on and when you fire up for the first time you get a ZX band um, screen come up with the version number, mine's 2.3 with a name of my device, I think it says 6.7, don't know why. And all we simply do now is we want to load programs up. So if we do a, a cat and push new line, brings up the directory of the memory card and you can see this is off my camera because of the DCIM folder. Now the files we're looking for are .p files, so there's crack, count, and that sort of stuff. So if I load up the count program, dot p for the extension in, and I push return and run it. What number should I count to? I don't know, 10, that do. And this is the count program I did in my previous video, which is gaming with one kilobytes. This is a Z span which is running as we saw, and it has 32 kilobytes of memory, meaning a major upgrade for this machine. So if I go new again, and cat, and what I want to do now is load a, another .p file, so I'm going to load a game up, so I'm going to load quack. And this is a clone of Flappy Bird. It's called Quack, this is for the ZX81. This has come from Bob Stuff. This was written recently, apparently, in 2014. This is harder, this is just as hard, if not harder, than the uh, original version on the phones. One more go. Okay, what we can do, get back to the main screen, is just push the reset button. Okay, no, there you go, reset's worked now. And push cat again. Now I want to look at something in a directory, say E dash, or QRS, I can just go cat, with the speech marks and QRS. And push return. And we get a list of games in there, all the .p files. Either games, applications, that sort of stuff. So I can just push new line for more. New line for more again. I'll go new line again. 
and I can see it in there it says scramble so all I have to do now instead of going through to the end of the directory and remember what it was push the space button and load QRS which is a directory full slash scramble dot P love this keyboard, this membrane keyboard and brilliant and we're going to push U9 and that's loaded up uh, scramble so we're going to push, it says press Y if you want 10 lives otherwise press no why would you not push yes? Okay, and P used to shoot there and L with bombs. This is impossible to play, it's very hard on this membrane keyboard. You take your fingers, you look away from the keyboard for one second, and you never get your fingers back in the right places to keys again. So I'm going to push L, bomb, 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 stuck can we bomb? Uh, this game doesn't seem to be. Oh, here we go. Oh, I've got six lives left. I lost lives when I'm running into brick wall. Oh, four lives. Two. Oh, my game's over. Maximum it says 10 I got for the score. And we reset the 81 again. Okay, and we're going to push cat again. And we look at, um, we can do adventure games. Let's look at, fuck oh, mate. Where are we? E2L, see what's in there. So we're going to do a random game. So cat again, E dash L. And that one, it's going to cut up again to A, B, C, D, A, B, C, D. Play more games here. See what one we can find. I want to see D. See if it's got um. You know. No. Okay. One more cat directory up, and we'll load T to Z. Just for space while I try any one. Okay, we're going to do load t dash z full slash and let's try tennis t e n n i s. Now, I've never played any of these games on here apart from uh, a few of them just to see what they look like. So, it'll be the first time I've ever played this tennis. Don't know what it's, I know it's going to be tennis, whether it be, I don't know, it might be the old pong clone or something on this. We'll find out. Oh, it's in a foreign language, so I can't read that. It's going to just do one. What well, is a pong clone? So, goes. So, I can. So, it's not going. That's a punk line, but I can't. Oh, there you go. So, um, so J goes up on that key, but don't come down. Oh, there you go, got him. So it's U H. Uh, 
and AZ. Oh look, I've got a ball stuck, look, UH, AZ. And I've got the ball stuck. It's a Pong clone for the old uh, ZX81, isn't it? It's like the old Pong games, you can get the ball stuck. So let me reset it, and we'll look at one more game. And uh, load, I know this one. 3D M M. It says anyone there, we're going to say yes on the keyboard. And unfortunately, I've got to watch all the text, and this is 3D Monster Maze on the ZX81. Try this text to scroll up. If you dare enter his layer, management. The management accept no responsibility for the health and safety of the adventurer who enters his realm. Management advise this is not a game for those of a nervous disposition. If in doubt, press stop. If instructions are needed, press list. Otherwise, press C or Cont. So, continue. The miss of time will pass over you for about 30 seconds whilst transporting to the layer of the Tyrannosaurus Rex. Best of luck. So now the ZX81 has gone out and it is thinking or putting all the information together. When I first tried this out, I thought, oh, the ZX band's crashed, but it hasn't, it's just thinking. And if you did it on a, an old school television, I presume that would be black and white or just a um, grey static which will be black screen so here we go this is the monster maze on the 81 so five let's go back so back forward I'm using left and right arrow keys so that's five and eight and six and seven up and down. Rex lies and waits. It's going to see Rex. Rex has always oh, seen us now. Go. Cool. We might get eaten by the monster. Here comes Rex. There he is. Hello, Rex. You have been posthumous. I think it says posthumously awarded sixty points. And sentence to the realm of the mace forever. Do you wish to appeal? Press stop, else press cont. I want to continue. I see we went round longer longer round the maze without being caught. So but he is hunting for you. Oh, footsteps approaching. Run, 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 we've got run because he's, oh, he's seen us again. We've got 90 points that time. I'm going to push stop and see what happens. So it's A. Appeal rejected. And then we reset this again. Right, I also look at the ZX band, loading directories and dot .p files on his ZX81. Been Retro Gamer JL. Till next time, 73s, cheers and beers, and subscribe for more retro gaming videos. And I'll catch you soon. Seven Freeze from Retro Gamer JL. Cheers and beers.